So so hello everyone and welcome back to the F1 2015 Nico Hulkenberg Arimut. So we are on my best car uh, track on the entire calendar, the Spanish Grand Prix. So we're on the qualifying session. I'm really expecting a very good result in the qualifying session, but my race pace is incredible in this track and I'm expecting a podium position. So I'm gonna load my setup and just go for some laps. So there we go on my lap guys, um, as we started pretty, as we lost uh, pretty much time there, into this uh, second corner, so I've done, okay we lost and time there, so um, yeah I didn't have a very good lap, but uh, the my other laps uh, were pretty slow, and uh, now I'm just gonna let you enjoy that lap, and I really hope to improve uh, them from my last lap. Yeah, get out of the way for stop and I'm doing a, a lap okay more time spent there to, for the overtake to first stop and so everything is going very wrong it's going pretty wrong there this uh, qualifying lap I think we're gonna stay where we are it's not gonna change a lot I'm gonna improve of course because it wasn't a very a very thoughtful lap but I think we're gonna lose time there uh, not lose down. Don't do it. Yeah, we we just stayed in sixth position. So we're gonna start the Spanish Grand Prix, if I'm correct, from sixth uh, position. So pretty much, let us go to the race. The circuit to Barcelona, Catalonia, a circuit that's seen some exciting racing throughout the years. Let's hope today's race will provide us with another chapter of drama. On pole for today's race is Sebastian Vettel, who'll be feeling very confident ahead of the start. He put in a wonderful performance yesterday, and if he drives like that today, well, he could be unbeatable. He'll want to stay out of trouble over the first few laps, but he'll be determined not to let any cars past him. If he can maintain that position once everything's settled down, he'll have a massive advantage and be able to control the race. Well, it wasn't a good race for Nico Rosberg last time out. It was his worst finish of the season, so he'll be looking to bounce back with a much better showing today. Nico was talking in the press conference early in the week about not dwelling on poor performances. He needs to forget Ooh. about the last race and concentrate on having a good result today. Wait, so eventually we started from fifth because Hamilton who was on pole got a penalty and now he's starting from six so he might have got five place grid penalty so so we're pretty much um uh the strategy was shit as you could possibly see it wasn't what am i going to do but well, pretty much the start of the race we start from six so it's one light two lights three lights four lights and it's five lights and away we go guys and we actually get off to a very good start there as uh we're actually closing it to Massa and we're gonna get his uh, outside line there and this is a up into P4 already and now it's all going to break his eyes um, on the first uh, corner and now into this corner as Raikkonen goes very slowly I don't know for what he's in there that we're going about okay I ran wide a bit there that might have been an illegal overtake but Cordis didn't uh, penalize me for that so uh, it's it's a move up into P3 and that's why we're wanting uh, a podium position. It's, it's just going to be amazing to to get a podium in this car and just in the first half of the season. So now next up ahead of us is Valtteri Bottas. But look at these corners. I really love this track. I just push the car into its limits in this track. I just really love this track. Well, anyways, we're on the slipstreaming of Valtteri Bottas and I try to. To outbreak him into this corner, the dive bomb, but I, I leave the brakes there, not to lock up 
pretty much uh, so that's why I run wide them um, now we're side by side with Valtteri Bottas down inside of Valtteri Bottas we stay there and that's gonna put us up into P2 clear move let's go now for Fettel so we're closing off Fettel who has tire issue problem get the fuck out the Fettel no so we passed him as he gets into the pizza so he might he might go for the undercut so let's see if his undercut is going to work so we're into the pit stops now, last a lap 5 Thank you, thank you Thank you CPU driver, thank you, thank you But I was running the pit stops at the moment, so I hope no one's going to uh, I thong, uh, I, th I thong, yeah I hope no one is going to pass us into the pit stops And this is going to happen exactly where we want it Let's see now if we're going to be ahead out of Fettel Which is very crucial if we want to win this race I think that's my toe. Not Stevens. We're into 11th and Stevens gonna get us. Just gonna get us there. Will the lad Stevens. Fettel is behind us so we might actually have it. Stevens I'm gonna I'm gonna fuck you up Stevens. I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm lit. We, we just start wheel twice there. Okay I'm gonna pass him there. Around the outside. What's he doing? He's going into my back there. What is he even doing? Are you freaking serious? Lap line, guys, and it's Patton just ahead of us who's into a lead, actually. You don't even know how he's in the lead. He might have not done yet his piece of it. We're going to go down the inside of him, up into P1, and we are now real contenders for the win of the Spanish Grand Prix as we are first, and we got like... Uh, Two laps to our next speed stop. So it's lap 11 and Raikkonen has an incredible pace and he's going now around the outside of us. We're going to try to stay into it down the inside. I'm leaving once again the brakes there. And uh, we actually took the corner pretty well there. Raikkonen is still there with us. We made contact there and Raikkonen is still there. We made, we made contact once again. But we're side by side with Kimi Raikkonen there. And uh, we're staying ahead of him. As uh, I am going to get into the pit stops on this lap, so Raikkonen and Bottas stay out for one more lap, and uh, we might we may are going for the other because I don't see any other guys beating at the moment. That might be actually bad because we might end up with a with an extra pit stop, but that might. Uh, open a better position for Hamilton and the others but we'll see if it if what we're doing is wrong but for the moment we need to we need to just be we need to just have the pace and control the pace of the races we see a battle there so it's lap 18 and I am getting into the pit stops once again as I'm in third behind Raikkonen and Hamilton but I'm going actually for a set of options, and I think that's a key move. So if I go into prime and finish the race, I think it would be very hard actually. So we're going for the known as three stop strategy. So we're going on that, and then on a set of prime tires, just because we need to get end on that set. But I'm going to get on that set in the end of the lap. Fed has got a problem. Fed has got a problem there, guys. And we were actually past him. He might have a mechanical problem. Mechanical issues there for Fettel. And now we might win the race. If I'm correct. But that extra pit stop might destroy us. It's Hamilton exiting the pit stops. I think now in, we are in a provisional first position. Fucking hell. It's Hamilton down the inside of me. Get us. Clearly get us. Trying to, uh, to make the undercut. Uh, not so... Okay, now, maybe now, better exit, but he goes better, oh yes, he blocks us a little bit, down this out, Lewis Hamilton, I'm so shit, like, I should have, I broke the guys, just to leave them in position, because, I just, no, I just bumped into him, sorry Hamilton, sorry, lap 25, and we, fuck these AI drivers, lap 25, and we're going now, into the, Pizza, so our last pizza, we must go uh, into the prime tires just for 
it's a, it is a rule actually, so we must go on this size. So our chances for a win are pretty minimized, but we're down to P5. And our chances for a podium are getting a little bit smaller. And we're going to finish the race. But anyways, I think the win is out of my plan at the moment, so I'm just fighting for the podium now. Seems like some guys are in the pits, including Raikkonen and Ross. We're going up into P3. Yes, podium position is there, guys. Last lap, last corner, and we're going to come across the line to take our first podium into the Nika Hogan Arena. Just look how close Rosberg was. One more lap, and we could be done. But I just won my first ever podium into this career mode with a full CDR with Nico Hulkenberg I'm just so happy oh my god and now I believe we can do more and more things in this career mode after that performance I think we can even fight for the championship with some wins okay I shouldn't even thought that because you're not going to be like no you're not I'm not going to fight for the championship I'm sorry because Hamilton is just flying the British championship I'm going to fight for the second position so let's see the driver, so the race results. Sublime drive. He looked very comfortable in his Mercedes this weekend, and it's rewarded him with 25 points. After all that excitement, it's time for a lie down, I think. Thanks for joining us, and goodbye until the next race. So that was the race. I just don't have words to describe the race. It was full of fun. I really enjoyed driving in this truck, like... I really enjoyed it, that's why I'm finishing third. It would be one more lap, and we might have got overtaken from Russell Well, You could have overtaken Valtteri Bottas who had tire issue problems, so it could be a second position, but I'm looking forward to the next races after that. And I, I, uh, I, thinking, I think we have potential for the championship. Okay, that, that's enough. Or for the second position, I told that. But the driver standing is win ninth at the moment, so that's why I don't think we're gonna win the champs because it's 73 points behind. So we might have to win races there back in the after uh, and after again. We need to win races back to back races. Yeah, that's gonna be pretty hard. So the constructors championships are as you know, and uh, we're pretty much there, being in the. Fifth position, so pretty much that was the video for today, guys. If you enjoyed, smash the like button. If you haven't subscribed, already subscribe. Follow me on Twitter and on Instagram. Ask me anything you want to ask a fam. Um, so yeah, that was it. Thanks a lot. I'll see you next time. Goodbye, lads.